For Ukrainians here in the mid-state, Russian invasion has threatened their loved ones back home. A Cumberland County family says they're trying to get their relatives in Ukraine out of the country, including a nine-year-old girl. Sonica Bargo joins us live in the ABC 27 newsroom with more. Sonica. Mark, Janelle, as of this morning, Daria Bedine's mother, sister, and daughter are safe in Warsaw, Poland. Now, Daria wants to get them to the States. When Russian bombs started falling in Ukraine... It was midnight and they started to hear the explosion. Daria Bedine's family started making plans to leave the capital, Kyiv. They have to immediately prepare some backpack and uh, some document. Daria is in the U.S., having just married her husband, Jesse. We had just gotten back from Texas. But her entire family, including her nine-year-old daughter, still in Ukraine. And it's like nightmare. Daria tried to get them out of the country. No train, no ticket for train, no ticket for bus. Um, it took about at least over 30 hours to get from Kyiv near the border. After two days, her mother, sister, and daughter finally made it to Poland, scared but safe. They can like breathe, and they're still like afraid of every loud noise. But her father and brother-in-law have been unable to leave, and they're less than a mile from some of the fighting. I just hope it's over soon, and no one wants to work. Daria says it's a struggle watching the war unfold from here. Oh, I'm so proud of my people of Ukraine and I am kind of wish I can be one of them. And she and her husband are still struggling, trying to bring her family together in the U.S. They don't have tourist visas or anything like that to come here. And we're really looking for someone to tell us what we do next. Daria and her husband plan to meet with an immigration lawyer to find out how to get Daria's family into the U.S. They say they want the family together and they want to be close enough to help. In the newsroom, Sonica Bargo, ABC 27 News.